guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns, but we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. In this Roblox mini-movie, Molly and Daisy are imagining what it will be like to grow up in Brookhaven. Daisy imagines becoming a princess, but Molly's vision of the future isn't so nice. There's a zombie invasion, stealing money from Brookhaven Bank, and breaking out of prison? Will Molly's vision of the future come true? Watch to the end of this video to find out. And guys, don't forget to slam that like button and comment below this video. We read all of your comments, guys. Molly, come on. Mom said we have to go to bed. But it's summer. Look, the sun is still out. I can't go to sleep with the sun still out. Well, Molly, in some countries, the sun stays out all night long. So you're just not going to go to bed? Exactly. Wait a minute. Seriously? The sun stays up all night? Yeah, for a certain part of the year, it does in certain countries. But not in my country. No, but can you imagine 24 hours of sunlight? That must be really weird. Yeah, exactly. But I would just go swimming and eat snacks and stay up the entire time. Oh, brother. Well, you can't. You have to go to bed because Mom said so. Ugh, I can't wait till I'm a grown-up and I can do whatever I want. Yeah, being a grown-up's gonna be pretty amazing. What do you think it's gonna be like, Molly? Well, this is what I sort of envision. Ah, oh, there's so much work to do as a grown-up. It feels like my chores are never done. Okay, I just gotta mop a little bit here. Ah, oh, these girls make huge messes everywhere. I wish someone would have told me that growing up was such a trap. I would have stayed a kid forever. And that's what I imagine it'll be like to be an adult. No, 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 Molly. Everyone knows it's sunshine, rainbows, and beautiful love. What? What are you talking about? I imagine being a grown-up goes something like this. Today we're gathered to join the hearts and hands of Prince Liam and Princess Daisy. Oh my gosh, Liam. I can't believe we're getting married. This is the happiest day of my life. I know what you mean, Daisy. You being my princess, it will make me happy forever. Okay, uh, let's get to the ceremony here. I have to get pizza. I'm really hungry. But we paid you for the entire hour. Yeah, are you gonna marry us or not? I'm trying to, but you two keep talking. Okay, do you want to be a princess and do you marry this guy? I do. And do you want to be her prince and marry this girl? I do. You're married. Congratulations. Now I'm gonna go get a pizza. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> That's what you think it's going to be like to be a grown-up? I know it's going to be like that, Molly. But you're not a princess. I will be once I marry Prince Liam. There's no such thing as Prince Liam. You don't know that. There could be a prince out there with the name Liam. And he's going to want to marry me, Daisy, the most beautiful flower in the whole world. <laughs> <laughs> Keep dreaming, Daisy. Well, if you think you're so smart and you know exactly what the future is going to be like, why don't you tell me what you think you're going to be like as a grown-up? Okay. I have it all worked out. <sighs> it's been such a long day. I can't wait to get out of here. I need to feed my dog. Don't they know I have a life outside of work? <sighs> hey, uh, I'm here to make a deposit. Luke? It is that you? Molly, I haven't seen you since, well, high school graduation. How are you? Oh, I'm good. I just got this important job at the bank. I basically spent my entire life here. Oh, wow. That's a great job. I started a tech company and, well, I'm here to deposit boatloads of cash. Whoa. Glad to see you've done so well for yourself. Oh, thanks, Molly. <laughs> hey, um... I was wondering, uh, would you like to have dinner with me and catch up? Really? That, that sounds amazing. Sure. You look really good, Molly. 
You're so grown up now. You too, Luke. So, um, when do you want to go out to dinner? How about right now? The bank's about to close. Sounds really amazing. Sure, just let me log off and, um, I'll meet you wherever you want. Okay, I'll see you at the diner in five. Wow, Luke's back in my life and I'm about to go on a date with him. Woohoo! Whoa, is that Luke's sports car? He really has done well for himself. Hey, Molly, over here. Uh, sorry, Luke. Uh, this date was last minute and uh, I didn't have time to change out of my bank uniform. No problem, Molly. I don't care what you're wearing. Let's go inside and get something delicious for dinner. It's so good to see you, Molly. It's so good to see you too, Luke. Where do you live now? Well, I was living in San Francisco, but I really miss Brookhaven, so I decided to move back. What? You live in Brookhaven again? Yeah, and the truth is I really wanted to see you. You did? Yeah, I really like you. I really like you too. I couldn't help but overhear your conversation and I just want to say, don't do it. Don't do what? Don't fall in love. It's a trap. It's evil. It, uh, true love doesn't exist. Whoa, you sound kind of jaded. <laughs> Did you get a broken heart? She must have. Yeah, so? Oh, love is it's fake. Um, I don't think all love is fake. You just haven't met the right person yet. Uh, what's your name? Cindy. And, um, Okay, fine. What do you want for your order? Whoa. <laughs> Could you be a little nicer, please? I've had a very long flight from San Francisco. Well, um, Cindy here just feels a little sad, Luke, because, um, her heart is broken. Okay, Cindy. Well, I'm gonna leave you a really big tip, and that'll probably make your day a lot better. Yeah, it really will. But love is still fake! Whoa, Cindy definitely has a chip on her shoulder. Um, uh, suddenly I'm not feeling very hungry. What about you, Molly? Uh, me either. Bye, Cindy! I'll still leave you a tip, though. Just don't want to be around someone who doesn't believe in love. Yeah, exactly. How about we go for a walk instead, Molly? Sounds fun. Let's go. Whoa, look. The moon is huge tonight. I know, right? So cool. Whoa, Molly, we've been talking and walking for so many hours. It's morning. Jiminy Cricket! <laughs> I'm going to be really tired for work today. It was so nice catching up with you, Molly. The hours just went by without even me noticing. I know what you mean. Hey, look, there's the old cemetery. Remember when the kids at school used to dare each other to go in there? Yeah, but we're grown-ups now. We're not afraid of the cemetery. Look, looks like there's a fresh grave. I double dog dare you to go in there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, Luke. All right, fine. Just for old time's sake. Wow. Well, what's that sound? Look inside, Molly. I triple dog dare ya. Okay, fine. Hello? Is anybody... Ah! What's that? Bah! Ah! It's Luke! It's a... It's a... It's a... It's a... A zombie! What? A, a zombie? Bah! Luke! Run! Ah! zombie all those years someone dared me to go into the graveyard i never did and i think i was probably smarter for that molly is that you are you okay molly come on get in my car no zombies are fast we have to find somewhere to hide i have the key to the bank come on i'll let us in and we'll hide in here okay you think this is a good idea absolutely come on we can go hide behind the desk the zombie will never think to look in the bank they're too dumb well molly i i have to say this first date really was Anything but boring. I have to agree, Luke. I kind of wish it didn't end with a zombie trying to kill us. Brains! Oh my gosh. Luke, the zombie is inside the bank? How'd they get in? I don't know, Molly, but I think we might have left the door unlocked. Oh, man! My knee. <laughs> what? Ma Stop beating your head against the ATM! Oh, M G! It's trying to break in! I didn't think they cared about money, just brains! Apparently this zombie is also money hungry. <laughs> Maybe they want a new outfit. Wait a minute. Did they just steal all the money? Get back here! Molly, stay low! You don't want it to come after our brains again, do you? Just let it take the money! Oh my gosh! The, the, the alarm's going off! Wait a minute, is it taking your car? Luke! Oh! My sports car! Come back here! Ah! Luke, wait! Come back! Are we gonna have a second date? I've gotta go get my car! Get back here, zombie! I'm gonna get you! Okay, well, call me! Oh my gosh, I have to call my boss and tell them that the bank's been robbed! Okay, it's ringing. It's, it's ringing! Why are the police here? Okay, good. This is perfect. I didn't call the police, but they can help me. Hello? In here! In here! The bank's been robbed! Hands in the air! What? No, I, I didn't... 
I didn't do it. Hands up. Okay, but I'm just saying, I, I didn't rob the bank. Well, you're the only one here who did. I can explain this whole thing, Mr. Police Officer. It was a zombie back from the dead. <laughs> That's the best one I've heard yet. Hands behind your back. But I would never steal from the place I work, ever. I don't believe you. You're arrested. But but there was a zombie and... and, 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 and I swear! You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. So I suggest stop talking about a zombie. You sound very crazy. But it's the truth! Shh! Okay, fine. All right, into the police car. Oh my gosh. This has turned out to be a crazy date! You're going to be put in prison for a long time. What? No, I'm not. I need a second date with Luke. Who's Luke? Who cares? You're in trouble, you thief! What? But I didn't do it! It was a zombie! Like I said, shh! Nobody knows the trouble I've seen! I'm stuck in jail forever! Molly? Is that you? Luke! Oh my gosh, Luke! They think I stole all the money from the bank! Even though I don't even have it, what would I do with it? That silly zombie ruined everything! Now there's these bars between us. Luke! I I'm missing you. I'm missing you too, Molly. Also, by the way, you look great in orange. That's a great color on you. Oh, thanks. I thought this prison outfit was kind of drab. You can make anything fab. You can take drab to fab. Oh, Luke, you say the sweetest things. Molly, there's only one thing for us to do. What, Luke? Be together. Stand back. W Luke, what are you going to do? I'm going to hotwire this and I'm going to get in here. And I'm going to open the bars and you're going to get out. What? Luke! I'm out! Thank you! Now come on, Molly, run! Oh my gosh, the sirens are going off! Ah, there's the police! Run! I shouldn't have eaten that second cupcake at lunch today. Molly, come in here! The police will never think to look in the church. Wow, this is a really nice church. I know, right, Molly? Um, so, uh, since we're already here at the church and everything, maybe, uh, we should... Get married. What? Get married? Are you serious? I just broke out of prison. What better time for us to commit our lives to one another? Well, if you really think so, then let's do it. Really? Yeah, I've loved you my whole life, Luke. Let's do this. We are gathered here today to join Luke and Molly in holy matrimony. Wait a minute. Did you just break out of prison? What? What are you talking about? You're wearing that orange jumpsuit. How rude! This is my wedding dress. I have been planning this day for months. I went to this special bridal shop that's very exclusive and picked this out. And you're saying it looks like a prison outfit? I'm very sorry. Okay, yeah, it's, it's a beautiful dress. Okay, can we get on with the wedding? Do you take this woman to be your wife? I do. Forever and ever. Oh, Luke, I love you. And do you take this guy, Luke, to be your husband forever? I do! I do! I do! Then you may kiss the bride! <laughs> Molly, that's the most ridiculous future I've ever heard in my life! <laughs> what? It, it could happen. Yeah, right, Molly. First, you want to date with Luke. Hey, that's believable. Uh, sure. Then there's a zombie. Uh-huh. Also could happen. Yeah, okay, sure. <laughs> then the zombie robs the bank and you get blamed for it and go to prison. Uh-huh. Also could happen. <laughs> Ridiculous, Molly. And then, if Luke breaks you out of a high-security prison and you guys get married, <laughs> that's the silliest and craziest, most ridiculous story I've ever heard. Go to bed, Molly. <laughs> Before my stomach explodes from laughing. Hey, Daisy, it could happen. It could happen. Uh -huh, Molly. <laughs> sure. Good night, Molly. I think it could happen. It really could. Well, Molly, I I'll see you in the morning. Have a good sleep. Hopefully you don't have another weird dream. I'm telling you, zombies are real. They really are real. <sighs> <sighs>